And here we are in Fazbear Frights. <laughs> Welcome everybody back to some more custom zombies. Here we are with uh, the third in the Five Nights at Freddy's map trilogy. I don't know if there's going to be more after this. Five Nights at Freddy's B. This time we got a bit of an Easter egg. We don't got an ending, I don't think, just yet. I don't know if he said I was going to add one. But got an actual little Easter egg to do here. The happiest day. Along with a, another smaller Easter egg. Which seems pretty crazy. We'll try to do also. Well, I say smaller Easter egg, but it's kind of nuts. It's not much of a quest, I guess is what I should say. Man, look at this map. It's even better than the last one. Looks so good. I need to get a. I should probably get a gun. I don't know if I should get the RK5 or <gasps> one of those guys. But yeah, I believe this map was made during Halloween. That's why you got some of the spookiness. What is this? I don't know what that is. I played this map a couple times. It's still. I don't know what that is. Like sometimes you drink stuff. I don't know what it does. Look. Another thing for the Easter egg song that I cannot do. Look at all the pumpkins. Look at all the spooky atmosphere. We're even in a cornfield. Oh, God. This has got that atmosphere. Oh, don't hit me. I'm fragile. I'm like Twitter. Oh, Jesus. It's 1500. I was really close to not being able to make up the amount. Let's go. Ooh, and them points. Oh, this is the origins the announcer. That's not where the thing is. Oh yeah, I forgot all the perks. Change each game. It's a thing in this map. Ah, uh, wait, these are. Okay, so the first one was World War II guns. The second one was Infinite Warfare guns. This one seems like it's Black Ops 4 guns. <laughs> we got a pattern here. I try to upgrade a bunch of weapons on this one also. It's gonna be a lot easier to do it on this one. So then I don't have to save up. Uh, I have to save up a bunch of points for any ending. Anything like that. I missed. You're too fast. Give me this. There's no round change music. If there is, I think it's because I turned the volume all the way down for the music. I'm straight up M16. Okay. Turn the volume down for the music, so uh probably it's probably tight to that. Jigsaw. But this thing used to scare me so much as a kid. That and I guess fit the Halloween atmosphere. That and Chucky used to absolutely terrify me as a kid like uh i can remember there's a video store i remember those were things i remember there's a video store that i used to go to when i was a kid uh or one time they actually got like chucky and uh i forgot what what the girl's name but her too as like the actual like dolls and put them on display i, I couldn't go past like the entrance i was too scared Ow. And seeing everything got loud. I couldn't go past the entrance. It just scared me way too much to actually go in there. I don't know why I was so scared of it. I think it was just the idea of a doll coming to life and and uh being all evil. That's scary. So scary. Can you blame me? So belly scary. I'd say it was the scariest thing around. There's a man behind the slaughter. Oh, I shouldn't have turned that on. Not yet, at least. I got jig. Got all that. I gotta. I gotta yeah. You gotta save up for uh for the perks because in three rounds we got a rampage round. That means all the zombies gonna be super super freaky deaky fast. That's gonna be so scary. I was scared of the of the what's it called. If any of you remember playing Mortal Kombat Deception, 
I was really scared of the fatality of Melina taking off her mask and biting off the thing with Jakey. I remember, I remember getting that game the first day it came out. I remember I even got like the special edition where you got like a card. I don't know where that is now. I'll be honest, I don't think we have it anymore. I remember it had like a Sub Zero card. It was really sick. But uh, the first day we got it, we did some of the some Melina uh, Melina's fatality of what she got. <laughs> when she took off her mask, I ran straight to the kitchen. I didn't want to see it. It scared me too much. Looking back at it now, this it is a little bit silly, but I also was a little kid. I don't remember exactly how old, but I was in elementary. At the very least. I mean, hell, even I've said it even with this with this game. The game's like well this game, not exactly this game, but like Black Ops 1, I was too scared to play zombies by myself. I was a I was a little scaredy cat when I was a kid. Not so much now. I don't think I'd be able to do any like Well, what could I? I'm honestly not even sure. But I kinda wanna do it, like I kinda wanna go to like Universal Studios, the horror the Halloween Horror Nights. I do kinda wanna I know where double tap is. I kinda wanna try that. But at the same time I feel like I'll be a little bit too scared. I don't know, maybe I'll try it one day. The Augur DMR. I think this is a fine gun. But yeah, something like Hall Halloween Horror Nights, I'd wanna try. This is the bad round. It is. It's me. Look. It's all scary. The, the zombie's gonna be all fast. And then, oh my god, it's gonna stop. And then I can't buy perks now. Oh my, this thing is so loud. There you go. Hindsight, it wasn't that hard. Upgrade this thing, because I need an upgraded weapon to start the Easter egg. Skull splitter. That sounds good. Look at this camo. It looks nutty. Man, this map looks sick as hell. Come on. There's two guns that are kind of goofy in here. Not that one. These two guns should be good for the Easter egg. Dead Man's Refractor. Alright, so to start the Easter egg, we gotta collect this. Bloom board faster. Then we gotta shoot that button, that button, that button, that button. In that order. And the next thing we gotta do is find some cupcakes and shoot them. There's one right here. One right there. I think the other two are on the other side. I don't wanna open that door. I got my little camping spot for this map already. Yep, there should be one right there. Should be one right there. Because those three are done. <clears throat> then for any of you uh for any of you uh Five Nights at Freddy's 3 enjoyers, we gotta do a very uh a very familiar step. That involves us being in the office. You'll 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 see. You'll see. You'll see once we get there. Come on, get over here. I don't know if a grenade will actually make you crawl there. Oh, that hurt. <sighs> I'll be right back. Well, actually, I'll show you the thing right now. It's do that. Three, nine, five, two. Four, eight. There you go. Once we do that, you heard the bring from the Gord Grovey. That means it was successful. And this will turn on. We can play FNAF 2. But since I downed also my perks, I can do that right now. Because I'm a little dummy. I'm let them trap me. I could have just shot. I could have just shot. Why didn't I just shoot? I don't know why I didn't just shoot. I gotta get Jug real quick. I don't want to die again. What are you gonna give me? A perk! It gave me Jug! Look at that! Oh, heck yeah. 
Why does it say my skull splitter is my third weapon? When I bought. Oh, whatever. Jesus Christ, this guy. No! <laughs> what in God's name? That? that just screwed me. Great. I don't get get my perks again. I want the rampart. <gasps> this is one of the goofy guns. Look at this thing. <laughs> goofy. Man, the ray gun marked. I can't take it. I, ca I can't have two guns, two wonder weapons. Like I want to take it, but I can't take it. I can't take it. I need like an actual like gun gun. Again, ruined revenger. Yeah, I'll kill these two zombies. I won't kill these two zombies. And I'll head over. Do this. Play Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Let's do this. Look at it. We're back in the thing. Yeah, but now you can see how this thing is. Look at it. <laughs> it just kills them. <laughs> it's so goofy. It actually, it works exactly like it do. I don't know how they made that work. I don't know how they managed to do that. That's the that's the Easter egg. I don't know what you get for doing it. That's the Easter egg done. And now this is the the thing with Jiggy. Yeah, look at me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see how this works in here though. I don't know what it does. All it does is gives you that emblem at the bottom left. But besides that, I couldn't tell you what it does. Look at all that. Jesus criminy. Boom. <laughs> so goofy. Oh god, I love it. It's <laughs> so silly. It's so sick. I got dead wire. Hey, look at that. Now upgrade the BFG. Why not? Look at this. Oh my god. The big fucking gun. 9,001. I almost got killed it. Well, I got a few more points that I could use. Next next uh, round is going to be the, the big old spooky round so I could do the Easter egg. Screw it. Okay. It was the super shotgun. That was in the box. I can't seem to get it, apparently. Okay, but the other Easter egg has to be round. Has to be a Ravager round, a Rampage round. Once that starts, okay. Apparently, I interact with this guy. I interact with him. Apparently I interact with him or something. It's gotta be like round two it turns to around two hundred or something like that. 
I don't think it worked. I heard him laugh. He doesn't usually laugh. So I don't know. Oh, 927. What the heck happened? Hmm. I'm not sure. It should have worked. I'll try the I'll try I'll wait for another rampage round and try again. There is an end game. What? I got the BFG at least. So boom. Alright. I'm gonna wait until I hear zombies spawning and interact with this creature. Interact with oh god. Oh jeez. <laughs> that went down real quick. Oh god. It has to go down that quick. Holy moly. Bro, I lost one of my weapons. Oh god. I just need 51987, I think. Then I could end the game. Yeah, no. I heard the, the, the thing laugh, but nothing. Okay, then, uh. I have one nine eight seven. What well, is that? Well, that lasted quite a few hits there. Double points. So. Okay, I got it. And we did it. We survived. We beat it. Okay. So I couldn't get the thing to work, but well. That's it for the Five Nights at Freddy's Custom Zombies Trilogy, I guess. You guys put down, uh, if there's any maps you want me to actually play on Black Ops 3, put them down into the comments, and I'll be sure to check them out. Until then, I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.